Hi everyone, Andy Davis here again from Master of Voice, a channel with reactions to performers from across the world. In this episode, another singer that's new to me and so many of you have requested that I react to several songs by her. This is Mon Laferta. You all, you all may have to help me out with that. But otherwise, we're going to jump right into her song that translates to Your Lack of Love which I believe she wrote after a breakup and she was feeling pretty depressed. So I'm curious to hear the song. Let's jump right in. That is so fun. I love it already. Some of the lyrics I printed out. Today I return to sleep in our bed and everything remains the same. The air and our cats, nothing will change. Difficult to forget you staying here. I want to see you. Still I love you and I believe even more than yesterday. The poison ivy does not let you see. I feel mutilated and so small. Come and tell me the truth. Be merciful and tell me why. Uh, and it goes on. And I, <laughs> I love her voice, though, the timbre of it. It's a little bit nasal, almost forward just a bit. But I'm enjoying this already. I love that. She certainly opened right up in her chest voice. It was very nicely done. Nice support on the breath there. And then at the ends of some of those phrases flipped up into her head voice quality. I enjoy her a lot. What a cool song. And to tell me why, how it was you stopped loving me. I could not bear your lack of love. A month ago, I would listen to you and be your accomplice. I thought there was no one better than you. I was your friend and your companion. Now I sleep very deeply to forget. I would like until death not to think. I race you to take away this bitterness. Come and tell me the truth. Be merciful and tell me why. How is it you stopped loving me? I could not bear your lack of love. Such heartfelt lyrics, but I like the upbeat style of this song, but when she opens up into that belty chest voice, you can tell she's pouring out some emotions. They love it.
enjoy this. She really tells the story in those verses and then opens up with such raw emotion in the choruses here. And the audience knows every word. I know this was popular. She actually, I believe, did a cover, a cut of this, if you will, just at her home and put it on YouTube. And it turned into such a big success that she was signed and recorded it and it became a huge radio hit. Another good band. I love the setting here too. I really enjoy this uh this setting here, it almost feels almost like a speakeasy back in the 20s with the cool lamps, her costuming, and I really enjoy it. I love that float up into a head voice she's doing at the ends of some of the phrases. Just really gives it a cool nuance after she's truly been pouring out her heart in those big belting sections. outpouring from her. You know, it was her original song, her original feeling. She knows exactly what went into this. And she's able to reproduce that for her fans in a live setting. And that takes a lot of professional talent, to be quite honest. And I really, really enjoyed this. I appreciate you all telling me about her, and I'm eager to react to more from her. If you enjoyed this reaction, please click like and hit subscribe as always. Leave me a comment down below and click the bell so you know when I'm releasing new content. Otherwise, I hope you all just have a great day.